Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to my Aladdin movie review. Late, late like usual, man. I've just been, uh, at this point, I, I kind of have nothing to do. I've just been lazy. <laughs> but anyways, I guess be best night late than never. So Aladdin is another one of Disney's uh, recreations into live action of their previous animated films. This movie is directed by Guy Ritchie and stars Will Smith, Nina Massad, and Naomi Scott. Mina Musad had never seen in anything before. Will Smith is pretty much Will Smith in this movie. Uh, Naomi Scott was good. Um, if I had to describe this movie in one word, it would be uninspired. I know technically it's inspired by uh, Aladdin, but uh, I mean, I just don't think there was any. They just at this point, I feel like Disney has just got this kind of conveyor belt. I know they do that with Marvel, except with Marvel that works. And in this case, they're just recreating what's already made, and even putting in the music, recasting everybody, and just doing it live action. And this movie just like the magic. And I don't know if I'm just older or what it is, but um, number one, I was really skeptical when they said they were going to make this movie. I think. Maybe two or three years ago I heard about this and it had only been like maybe two or three years um, since Robin Williams' death at the time. Um, so I was very skeptical and they said Will Smith and I was like, okay, well maybe he can pull it off. And um, yeah, I mean, he, 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 he did a decent job. Everybody is serviceable in this movie. Um, but uh, I mean, this is just an average movie. I don't need to ever see it again. I've got the original one. Um, Guy Ritchie... Um, I'm actually not a very big fan of his. I thought the Sherlock Holmes movies were boring. Man from Uncle, I fell asleep during that movie. Um, there's just nothing special here. It wasn't bad. It wasn't great. It's just average. If I had to rate this movie on the Star Strider scale, I would give it a 50. There was just... Uh, I mean, uh, Marwan Kanzari is uh, Jafar. It's, it's, it's He does okay. I mean, everything is just kind of bleh in this movie. Uh, I think, I don't know, I, I feel like these movies, because they're profitable, it's easy for Disney just to be like, just keep cranking them out, cranking them out. Even if, you know, they only make $30, 50000000 million, that's still profit, that's still money in the bank, pleases their investors. And, um, I mean, I think Marvel seems to be their flagship uh studio at this point because i mean pixar they keep going back to the well with toys 3 or a toy story i'm mean, toys 3 toy story 4 um star wars is creatively bankrupt um these disney things they just keep this like dumbo lion king aladdin lion king i'm actually excited for it looks good um you know so at, at this point of, of all these recreations the one only one i really really liked was Beauty and the Beast and for some reason with that one I I kind of was really looking forward to um even Jungle Book I wasn't that impressed by this the technology I was but I never really liked the original Jungle Book to begin with um Lion King I'm excited for but this movie is just uh if you're not a big movie fan just uh, skip this one it's an average film it's a 50 out of 100 it'll be forgotten um I mean, it's just you can't replace you can't replace Robin Williams at all. Um, Will Smith, he's okay though. He wasn't like terrible. He wasn't trying to be uh, Robin Williams, which I respected. But anyways, yeah, it's it's an uninspired average movie. Um, anyways, what did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Please like, please subscribe, and hit the bell. All right. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Okay, bye.